Hi everyone, thank you for stopping by for another video. This features an excerpt of Dr. Sebi answering a question on magnesium. So I want you to listen very carefully to what he had to say. Here we go. Um, I guess another thing I was uh, thinking about was uh, the importance of magnesium. And I, magnesium? Yeah, yeah. So if you can just touch on those two, uh, you know, I'd appreciate that. Magnesium is a very important mineral. It's a mineral that addresses the central nerve system especially. Magnesium also works with calcium to strengthen the bones. But when we talk about magnesium, magnesium is found on the planet expressed on two levels. One outside, one fluorine. Meaning that the outside is the rock that has magnesium. Fluorine means the plant that has magnesium. So naturally, we will consider the plant because it has what? Carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. It's alive. The magnesium is alive now. It would assimilate. Magnesium is extremely important to the body, as Dr. Sebi pointed out. A deficiency in magnesium could affect the nervous system, the bones, the muscles, and other parts of the body, and also body functions, of course. Magnesium combines with phosphorus to form one of the great phosphates. That is magnesium phosphate. And you would have heard Dr. Sebi mention magnesium phosphate in other videos. It is considered brain, nerves, and flesh food. You could find magnesium in Dr. Sebi approved herbs such as the Crunjus crispus or Irish mash or sea moss, the bladder rack. Those are some good sources. And of course, a number of other herbs that are Dr. Sebi approved, including sarsaparilla, stinging nettle, condoranga, and hydrangea, to name a few. I hope you found this video useful. You can drop your suggestions down below and look forward to another video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment, of course, and also check out the blog, theafricanbiomineralbalance.com.